Good morning, Fall City Middle School. It is Monday, April 26th, the last week of April. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. On this Monday, happy birthday, unbirthday, sorry, not really your birthday, Madison Eberly. So I hope you have a wonderful Monday. And for your unbirthday, Madison, we're having country fried steak, mashed potatoes, California vegetables, pears, hot roll, and a milk. Let's see, what else? Just don't forget, if you want to do summer rec, please get signed up ASAP. Again, there will be no speech today, just so you guys know. Um, registration forms uh, for the Fall City Barracuda swim team are due by Friday. So those of you that want to be on the swim team, talk to Mr. Lampy ASAP. Uh, next, just want to remind you, we talked about this on Friday. Boys, in the 8th grade especially, there is to be no hitting each other. Especially in the special area. Alright? Because... That's how we get fights, and I do not want you to be suspended through the end of the year. And we are almost into the 10-day window. When we get into the 10-day window, you get suspended, you start summer early. All right? And I don't want you to miss the awards and promotion ceremony and all the cool stuff that happens at the end of the year. And maybe the most cool thing, the fistulated cow that's coming the second to last week of school. So, just don't put, keep your hands to yourself. Safe hands, everybody. All right. A-OK -okay of the day. Got going from Miss Bankhauser out to Kirsten Harmon. When she came to school, she stopped to tell me about the sirens and the dark smoke she saw that was coming. She saw on the way coming to school. We talked about what it could be and how close it seemed. At the conclusion of our chat, she told me to have a nice day. So thanks, Kirsten, for being such a positive influence in our school. And speaking of that, our words of wisdom today are about goodness. Someone wise once said, the way to build a better tomorrow is by building better people. And how do we do that? Listen to these words from English theologian John Wesley. We do all the good we can, by all the means we can, in all the ways we can, in all the places we can, at all the times we can, to all the people we can, as long as ever we can. Remember, Today and every day can be a new beginning. Be especially good to yourself and others. And together we can build a better tomorrow. With something to think about, it's Mr. Banger. Make it a great day or not because that choice is always yours. Eighth graders, three weeks, no more middle school ever again. You'll be out of here, so make it a great three weeks, everybody. And for the rest of you, you have like three extra days, so really don't get out that much earlier. But have a great day, everybody, and I will see you tomorrow.